Hey, my name is Dr. Dredd. I'm an Adam All-Star and I skate for the St. Louis Skatekeepers. I'm here today, I wanna to tell you about my Adam trolley bag. I wanna tell you about what I keep in it and how I put it in there. I've had this trolley bag for about six years. I take care of it, so it takes care of me. Okay, so first I wanna talk about the handle area of the top of the bag. Um, as you see up here on top of this handle, there's a clip and inside this clip, I, I just keep my headbands attached on there. That way they can dry out after practice or after a game. Um, I also have this really nifty uh, headband up here that a friend of mine made for me. On one side it has the Batman logo and the other side of it, it has the Skulls logo. Uh, this was made just sort of kind of a remembrance deal for Batwing when he passed away. Okay, so next thing, let's talk about the backpack that comes on top of the bag. Um, a lot of people may unzip this and think that it's an extra pocket down inside here, but actually if you unzip it all the way off, it becomes an extra backpack. Um, I use this for tournaments, and whenever we travel long ways, I'll put wheel bags down inside here, and I also use it for trail skating and things like that. Um, also, once you take that backpack off, this will become a carry-on item for airports and airplanes and things like that. Okay, let's talk about the outside pouch that goes in between the backpack and the bag itself. Um, to make this a little bit easier to access, I'm gonna go ahead and unzip the bag itself. Kind of relieve some of the pressure off of it. Um, in here, I keep whistles and sweat rags and um, like an extra mouth guard and things like that. You know, miscellaneous things that um, I don't need all of the time. Okay, moving to the inside of the bag, this zip up mesh pouch on the inside. Um, in here, I keep uh, clean extra headbands, um, a few different sets of armbands, you never know, you know, I mean, how many sets of armbands you'll need. Some, uh, some kind of a, candy bar or, or granola bars, or in my case, big bars, I like big bars. Um, and a few extra sets of shoelaces, pretty much. I think just things that I know that I'm gonna need to dry out, and whenever I get to a place where I can just leave my bag open, they will kinda dry out, or things that I'm gonna need immediately that I know I'm gonna go through, I keep inside this pouch. Okay, so let's talk about the inside of my bag. Um, this bag does come with a divider so you can separate your clothes from your gear. Um, I'll talk about that in a couple seconds. First thing I do wanna talk about is my tool bag. I keep all my tools in this and I keep spare parts like pivot cups, kingpins, and a few extra bearings and a few sorted other things. And I also keep tools for other brands of skates because you never know whenever your friends skates are gonna explode or something bad may happen. So, um, moving on, I generally put my skates in my bag toe down. So this is the bottom of the bag and this is the top where the handle is. And I will put them in like so. And the reason why I put them in toe down is because I keep um, like a moisture absorbing bags down in my skates to absorb all the moisture out of them. Uh, next thing I generally keep in there will be my wrist guards and I usually slide them in the plate kind of like that and then on top of that I'll, I'll slide my knee pads and then on top of those I'll go ahead and I'll put my my elbow pads um, back to this particular the the dividing piece um, my helmet is kind of large I use a hockey helmet uh, with a visor on it so if I'm going on a long trip, sometimes I'll put that separate from my bag or put it in a, a backpack or something like that and I will separate these and I'll put clothes inside my bag. Uh, uniforms, uh, you know, t-shirts, socks, whatever I may need. But just for practice sakes and stuff like that, I keep a, a you know, a sweat rag down in my bag and I also keep a bag, a little uh, bottle of uh, pad cleaner or pad spray. Then, uh, like I said, my helmet takes up a lot of room, so I put it up top 
and it also keeps it protected so the skates aren't bouncing on it whenever I'm wheeling it down the sidewalk and hitting cracks. Um, also keep an extra set of wheels. Um, depending on the weather, what the hardness will be, I keep those inside my helmet, tucked up like that. And yeah, that's about it. I usually keep it like that and zip it on up.